Hey guys, you know the routine. So first things first, what I'm doing is just putting my hair into four sections. I am attempting to um, braid them. I'm not very good at corn rolling, so I'm attempting to braid them down. And the reason that I do this is so that it's easier for me to manipulate my hair while in the shower. Um, shampooing and combing my hair as conditioner and so the moisture my hair. Okay, I am fresh out of the shower. My hair is not completely saturated anymore. I did towel dry just a little bit. Um, I know you guys noticed the different backdrop. I have to stop um, filming in my room because it's entirely too dark. And, you know, I um, know that, you know, people weren't able to see um, some of the things that I was doing when I was trying to get the tutorials, tutorials and things of that nature. And as well... I believe the audio was down really low, so I have moved into my kitchen, and so, um, you know, I can speak a little louder in here. Um, well, not speak louder, but you probably can hear me better in here. The acoustics are a little bit better, because it's a wider space, and um, of course, I'm in front of a white backdrop, so I'm assuming you guys can see me a bit, but better. So, a bit, bit better. <laughs> but anyway, um, I am about to get started with... Um, my roller set, I'm gonna go ahead and pull out my products and show you guys what I'll be using. Basically what you do is just take the hair, sorry, make sure you guys can see, and you just want to make sure you wrap it all the way around, and then start to roll, pulling it as tight as possible, tucking it, pulling it, make sure you all have all the hair on the roll, someone will try to get away, pulling it, tucking it, pulling it, tucking it. it and there you go and this is just one of my more sloppier roller sets it's not perfect it's not like a salon um 
real estate, but it will come out the same way. Basically, the reason why I did it this way is just to show you that, you know, you can do your own real estate at home. They don't have to be perfect. They could be spare of the moment. I just felt like rolling my hair. Um, as you can see, I was distracted singing, talking to my roommate, doing all kinds of stuff. Um, and it'll still come out fine. So I'm going to go ahead and get under the dryer. And then when I come back, I'll show you guys the results. Okay, guys, so I am back from up under the dryer. And my hair is like part way um, dry. In the front, it is completely dry. I've already removed um, some, like two rollers. And you can see the curls. It's part ways dry. I'm going to remove a few more um, just to show you guys what the curls will end up looking like. And closer to my roots, you will realize, like, you can see it's more textured than it is at the bottom. Um, basically, um, I can pretty much show you guys what I do to um, help that or whatever so that it doesn't really interfere with your styling. Some of these aren't all the way dry. Um, I try to stay away from heat as much as possible. The only time I really put heat in my hair is if I'm getting my hair straightened. And so um, when I do styles such as this, I try to utilize air drying as much as possible. Um, what I did was let my hair air dry for like 30 minutes. And then I sat under the dryer for 30 minutes. And now I'm about to air dry the rest of the way. So the curls that I'm taking to loose in the back, because I know they're not all the way dry, I'm trying to leave them in their form as much as possible so that they can dry in a curl form and not, you know, revert back to trying to be straight or whatever else. So, yeah, they came out pretty good. And like I said, if you just want to do a simple style, you just want some curls, like you can do it yourself. And just because your hair is natural, or because you have a new, lot of new growth in your transition. Or if you're relaxed and you around that time you need a relaxer, like you can still style your hair. And it'll come out fine. What you need to do is just, I might have to roll some of these back up. But basically what you need to do is just oil your hair really well near your scalp. What I do is take my um, coconut oil and I oil it really well. Most of the time I'll leave it like this the first day. And then at night, of course, when I... Um, when I pin curl my hair, I go ahead and moisturize pretty well um, towards my scalp and towards the end so they don't poof out or anything like that. But yeah, that's that. And I don't know how well you guys can see um, my hair or whatever. I need to start filming with the other camera, but I'm just using my webcam right now. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to go pluck these out a little bit and maybe like Pull it up in the front. I might go get my coconut oil and show you guys how I do that. And pretty much that's it. That's all you got to do. Nothing to it but to do it. <laughs> Thanks for watching. You guys be cool.